Good day, YouTube. Back with another video. As always, it's gonna be short. I'm trying not to keep my videos long, but this is just to show you how I transported my boat and some of the things I learned from taking it out on the water a couple of days ago. So here we go. This is how I loaded on the back of my truck. I have a Chevy Silverado 1500. Uh, the bed is about six feet and 83 inches long. And so the boat hangs off about roughly about two feet maybe. This is how I have it strapped down. Nothing too crazy, but it's not going anywhere. You pull on it, tug on it, it's not going anywhere. I have a couple straps running around. That's the carpet. Underneath the carpet is a piece of plywood that I had glued down and stapled down, so give me a better surface to stand on so I'm not slipping everywhere. And I got those straps tied up to here. Oh, man. And so that's pretty much how I transport it for right now. Nothing too crazy. Um, like I said, this is how much it hangs off the back. A um, couple of things I have learned from taking it out on the water the other day was I had way too much gear. Um, so definitely need to condense that down. Um, two rods was pretty good. So that wasn't bad at all. My fish finder worked great. The trolling motor worked awesome. Um, I know I keep repeating myself about that anchor, but I definitely need to get that because um, I was just drifting everywhere. And so, um, but other than that, everything went well. Like I say, once again, I'm going to take it out on the lake next time in the pond and see the difference in the water size to see how the current works there to see the difference in everything. But overall, it was a success. In this video, like I said, it's more geared around to show you how I load it up and how I have it strapped on the back of my truck. And I just keep my gear in the inside of the truck. I have a decent sized cab right there where I keep my uh, chairs and everything else, trolling motor, all that inside of there. So it's not out in the elements. But um, yeah, so that's pretty much how I transport my nothing special. I need to get a trailer so it can make it easier for me when I'm dropping it in the water. I don't know if you can see, but you can see where the water line was coming to when I was when I had it in the water. Um, so, like I said, pretty stable boat. Easy to transport, easy to take off and load up. Nothing too crazy. I was able to do it by myself. Put it in the water and take it out. Also, too, one more question. Um, Y'all can help me out with this. So when I do decide to get that anchor, I run my trolling motor in the back. Should I anchor up in the back on the same side that the trolling motor on, or should I anchor up in the front? Um, I'm not sure, so if y'all can help me out with that, that'd be awesome.